What's good guys, Zinus here and today in this video of Idol of Fantasy Star Saga, I am presenting to you guys a reroll guide where I will be teaching you guys on how to reroll in this game. Right over here in the screen you can see that I've got an account but I'm not really happy with this account because I was not able to get the 5 star hero of my choice let alone getting the multiple units of 5 star net hero units. Alright, so let's get started right away. How to create a new account. First of all you need to exit the game and relaunch the game again, alright, because everything is in the login screen where you will be able to manage multiple accounts all right let's get this started let's click on the option menu that is on the bottom left corner all right and click on the user center this is the place where you will be managing multiple accounts that you have binded with this game all right so right over here guys uh, this account right over here is the one that is active right now that i'm using to play this game uh, you can actually change the account in order to log in with the other account so that you can play this game at different settings or whatever that is and let's look into the login other account so this one right over here guys this is the one that you need to utilize in order to create new accounts uh, sadly you cannot just reset the data or clear the data or delete the data of the current profile in order to start a new account in the same you know like gmail account or facebook account okay you need to have different or multiple facebook account or gmail account in order to start a new idol of fantasy star saga account that is really not good i mean like most of the rpg games lately are actually introducing this kind of concept and i'm not really a big fan of it because you really need to engage into a lot of multiple google gmail accounts or facebook accounts in order to create new account and eventually you will run out all right and you really are kind of like limited or you are you really are forced to select the best account with which you have really got good hero units so far all right so that is pretty much it so what are we gonna do right over here definitely i will li love to create a new account with my facebook account so all right let's go on guys continue as genos let's do it guys let's do it all right <laughs> and it says toss the screen all right there we go and as soon as you start the game what's going to happen is that you will be provided with the chance to summon or let's say to do the multi summons right away just like this okay so this is how it goes guys this is how it goes so be prepared with multiple accounts all right so that is one animation right over there which is actually trying to say to you guys that you are getting one of the really good uh, summon right over there guys ladies and gentlemen anyways this is the first multi summon that you will be able to get right off the bat when you start account and this is the hero that i actually managed to get which is a really good hero unit all right there we go shasha or as well uh-huh that's good and boozer all right that's cool these are the new hero units raquel <laughs> oh man i wish i could get raquel in the excess heroes but well that is not the case right now right <laughs> uh, abiel wow I actually managed to get so many hero units wow that's good that's good all right and one five star net hero unit that you can see right over here this this unit right over here guys all right so that's how it is and i can now just click on the return and this is the time to play through the contents all right uh, right over here you can just go with anything you can uh, change your name later on as well uh depending upon your birth date your element will be selected that's how it is in this game <laughs> You know, like the zodiac signs, there are a total of four elements in this game, right? So uh, every zodiac signs have like three months of validity, right? So that means in a total of one year, there are a total of uh, four element signs: earth, uh, fire, water, uh, and what is the another one? Air. Yes, air, air. Okay. <laughs> so there we go, guys. Anyways, those are the you know like the the, the basic concepts of the zodiac signs. Anyways, let's keep it on. Let's go and add. Okay. The only thing that is so bad in this game definitely is going to be the requirement of multiple Gmail accounts, multiple Facebook accounts, or let's say multiple, you know, like the mailbox accounts in order to create new uh, game account in this game, okay? So that is the problem right over there, guys. But uh, if you are pretty much lucky right off the bat, uh, when you start really early in this game, then no need to reroll, okay? So you can just keep on enjoying this game right away ASAP. So there we go. I'll just go with the fast mode battles. Uh, I'm really happy that the two times, uh, you know, like speed of the battle mode is already active. And that is really cool, guys. I really like that. Uh, because in most of the other RPG games out there, we have to battle the opponents with, you know, uh, like, what do you call this? One times the speed. Like, what? Yeah, that is a really big problem, right? So anyways, just click on this, uh, you know, like this, this section right over here, which also like do the EB skip. 
Okay, so there we go. So that like we can actually progress much faster in this game and uh, try to get to that phase where we will be done with the tutorial phase and finally able to claim those mailbox items and um, start doing our multi summons and see like what we are able to get okay so there we go tap tap all right start and boom there we go start all right let's do it let's try to beat them up okay there we go sadly guys you cannot really delete the game account that's binded within the Google account or the Facebook account that you have just used in order to create a new account in this game. So that's a really big problem, guys. That's a really big problem. Oh man, just like in Exos Heroes. Wow, <laughs> what the hell? Anyways, uh, let's just keep on heading on, guys. Let's try to do our best, all right? This game is a turn-based strategy, strategy uh, or let's say RPG gacha game. And definitely you will love to play this game, I guess, because of the really good um, character animations. You know, the avatars animation is really, really good. I really like that. It kind of reminds me of the Guilty Gear XX. Uh, where the characters are very fluid, right? And similarly, this game is also like that. I mean, like, I think we could at least expect that kind of things from the Sega games, right? So there we go, guys. We are going to fight against the boss right over here. Uh, let's try to defeat him. All right, there we go. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's just skip. Yes, all you need to do is keep on sk skipping, guys, and click on that start in order to deal some damage to the uh, boss right over there. Mm -hmm. Boom, just like that. All right, looks cool. Mm -hmm. There we go. He actually did some kind of, like, pathetic damage right over there. All right. Defense up. All right, there we go. Some damage to the opponent. Mm -hmm. All right, there we go. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, it looks really cool so far. Looks really cool. Okay, so there we go. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, elemental blast. Yes, we can do some elemental blast. That's gonna actually trigger some really good animation, I guess. Okay, so there we go. All right. The animation is kind of oh, disabled right now because like I just see, said that EB skip. Okay, so there we go, guys. That's how you are supposed to uh, do the reroll in a really fast manner. Okay, and just skip whatever that is. Not really that important. <laughs> and if you can skip, just skip it. All right, there we go. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, there's some like really good story going on around. The story plot is kind of really interesting, I guess. If you guys are really fan of any kind of like story out there of the RPG Gacha Gamings, this game is definitely going to provide you guys a really good in-depth uh story experience all right so there we go all right so there we go guys ah now this is the time to set up our team just do the auto setup and everything will be done for you how convenient isn't it <laughs> really convenient for me ladies and gentlemen i really like that i really really do like that so let's go on Okay, there we go. This woman is not really going to leave me until I'm really done with the tutorial phase, okay? And when she leave me, that is the time when I will be really uh, moving forward to the re-rolling section, okay? Because that is the time when I will be doing a lot of summons. All right, there we go. Let's try to select one uh, helper and uh, we are going to fight against the boss unit or maybe you know, the normal story units, all right? <laughs> let's see what we are going to fight against okay some birds guys let's try to burn those birds up and let's roast them okay so there we go oh my god we are going to skewer them uh -huh, okay all right all right let's try to make some chicken tandoori with them <laughs> all right all right man all right there we go there we go mm -hmm. that's nice that's nice let's let, let's get them let's get them mm -hmm. all right all right all right Boom, there we go. Let's try to provide some really good buff to my team. And boom, there we go. Let's start the battle. And yes, there we go, guys. Boom. Mm, looks really cool. Looks really good. Uh-huh, okay. I didn't try this one. Oh, yeah, you can auto as well. Yes, the auto feature is active from the very start of the game, which is so much convenient compared to other RPG games out there because the auto feature is kind of locked on less you actually complete so many features in the story mode right but in this game the auto feature is available to you guys right at the bat without any problem at all so you know like it's too easy in this game all right it's too easy in this game all right let's keep on moving on ahead uh let's see if that woman is still going to follow me it seems so it seems so okay come on lady pop up are you going to pop up <gasps> oh this is the time to return back and see how fast it was how easy it was all right now this is the time to check out on the login rewards what are the login gifts that we are going to receive for logging in the daily and you can see that like so many amazing rewards are waiting for me all right especially at the end of the uh, ordeal right over here guys look at that that's cool 
and welcome bonanza as well wow look at that those items really looks very amazing shining and glittering and this thing right here guys the summer vacation login bonus is going to provide us a one multi summer right of the bat if we keep on logging in daily so that is good guys that's really good okay uh yeah you're right right yes there we go so tap to continue and now this is the time that we will be checking our mailbox okay so let's get into the gift all right and just wait for some time for this to load up tome of universe it says uh which is quite useful in upgrading your characters star diamond that is the main gacha currency in this game which you are going to require in order to do the gacha summons in this game all right and next is going to be the star diamond and day one login bonus right over there and the next thing is going to be the 10 times gacha ticket luckily guys this is the new feature that is just added recently a uh, few hours ago it was not available because the game was really lagging so much and they have you know like the developers seems to have already like fixed that problem but due to the inconvenience uh, the developers actually came up with this plan to provide every one of us the 10 times gacha ticket which is actually making our rerolling uh quest even more fun okay so there we go guys that's really cool so definitely claim all all right there we go and boom right over there and this is the time to do more summons, all right? So can we do it? But before that one, guys, we need to get this 1500 uh, diamonds, okay? So for that one, we will need to go back to the quest, okay? We will need to go back to the quest and let's try to do some more battles so that we can actually get uh, some more <laughs> star diamonds, okay? So there we go. Let's try to make that 1500 because 1500 is at least the minimum amount of star diamonds that you are going to require in order to do one multi summon. All right. So let's do the summons at once. All right. So party setup. Let's do it. Let's try to set up the party. There are two types of team that you can uh, involve within a party. One is going to be the law type. Next one is going to be the chaos type. Chaos type of hero units are specialized in dealing a lot of damage to the opponents. Hear me out. All right. So there we go. Guys. Whereas for the law type of hero units, they are specialized in. Uh, healing and tanking the damage all right there we go so that is it all right uh let's try to select one um you know like alloy and let's just go with him okay let's go with go with the flow let's go with the flow <laughs> all right ladies and gentlemen we are going to go into the battle against the opponents let's just auto it man let's just auto it there's no, no there's no need to actually do any kind of manual modes all right so there we go guys mm -hmm. looks pretty cool it's pretty fun all right, there we go. Boom. Come on. Just kill them already, okay? Let's, let's just, just just get rid of them really fast. Okay, so there we go. Mm -hmm. Looks cool. All right, some really good damage on the opponents. There we go. Uh, now, this is going to be the second wave of the battle. All right, taunt. Mm -hmm. That's going to be the main damage, the burst damage of the uh, hero unit that I had. And he actually did some really good area damage to the opponent. And boom, there we go. We actually stood victorious. All right, now let's go into the next mode. All right, so we actually managed to get some really good reward right over there and some star diamonds. Did you see that? 100 star diamonds just like that, just for clearing one content. Just think about it, like how frequently you will be able to do the multi summons in this game. All right, just one more battle, all right? Hang on tight. Hold on tight, guys. Hold on tight. Just one more battle and we will be able to proceed into the rerolling re section. Okay, so there we go, guys. All right. So, uh, well, party setup. up. Uh, let's try to fight with the, uh, you know, this uh, chaos team. Okay, so there we go, guys. All right, because chaos teams are the one that is actually so good at uh, dealing a lot of damage. Okay, all right, all right. So there we go. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's do it, guys. Let's do it. Baka! <laughs> oh, man, that's classical way to scold a person, man. Baka means idiot, right? <laughs> yeah, that's cool. That's cool. Okay. So there we go. All right. Let's sound 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 sounds good. All right. Instead of auto, uh, let's see what we can do. Mm -hmm. Chop chop. Okay. So just double double battle. Okay. Let's just do it. I just want to do some manual, uh, you know, like manual control. I, I like. I want to enjoy this game as well, you know. While we are at it. <laughs> All right. That's gonna be the battle number two. Okay. So there we go. Uh, I think we can actually unleash this ultimate attack. Okay. So there we go. Of the hero unit, so that we can actually go fast. Boom, there we go. Look at that, man. The graphical animations of these special uh, moves or ultimate moves really looks very, very good right over here. And nearly on the par of Epic 7. Just look at that, man. It's quite cool. It's really, really cool. It's really cool. I think Epic 7 is still a little bit better. 
comparatively. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section below. All right, there we go, guys. Okay, let's try to uh, use some uh, special skills uh, against this opponent right over there. Boom. Uh-huh. Nice. There we go. That's how it's done. That's how it's done. And let's try to fight against the opponent right over there, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, short break. All right. Mm-hmm. Let's try to unleash this one and let's just do the auto mode, okay? <laughs> okay, there we go, guys. Wow, look at that, man. Look at that. Okay, there we go. You can actually skip this one by just uh, clicking on that uh, double the speed icon right over there on the top left corner. Okay, no problem at all. It's too easy. Just click on this one and there is the EV skip. Like that. See how easy it was. Really easy, wasn't it? Okay, there we go, guys. That is it. All right, come on. Die, 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 boss. Okay, his HP is on the top right uh, corner. Okay, there we go. Boom. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, there's some really good healing going on. All right. All right. Okay, he's going to die really fast. 775 points left. On his HP. Oh, man. There we go. That was some really good, uh, what do you say, this special skill. And some really good damage on the opponent. And this is the time that I'm going to defeat the monster. Ah, oh, okay, that is it, guys. Wow, wasn't that fun? Really, think about it. That was really fun, wasn't it? And this is the time that we will be doing our multi summons because I think we have attained the enough amount of resources to dig in and to the gacha summons. All right, okay, there we go. The new uh, content is unlocked right over there. Okay, but before that one, let's try to do our main reroll stuff. This is the place where you should be uh, halting for a while and pay a visit to the summoning section, the summoning area. And let's do this, man. Let's do this. Loading screen is just too long in this game. Come on, it should be flawless. It should have been flawless. This is the thing that's actually just killing my time. Anyways, right over here, what I really do have is like one multi-summon gacha ticket, okay? So right over here, you can do that just uh, easily because you just got from that from the mailbox. And this is the another summon that we will be able to do later on. Anyways, first of all, let's look into the possible rewards. There's only 2% chance to get the 5-star character. So don't really put a lot of expectations, all right? 2%, I think it's pretty fair deal uh, because it's an RPG game, all right, compared to other games out there i think two percent is pretty good enough for four star character uh it's a five percent chance to get in one time sketcher but if you do the ten times sketcher nearly 43 percent chance that you have in order to summon that uh four star character for three star character 38 percent chance and blah 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 all right let's do it guys let's do it let's do it i hope that uh, summoning girl to pop up okay because I really cannot afford to use so many multiple uh, accounts, you know, like to keep on summoning. All right, come on, girl. Oh, I think she did not appear. Yes, the girl did not appear. That means I got no five-star hero in it. Mm. Lana, I think she is a three-star. This guy is a three-star as well, I guess. There we go, guys. Oh, Kank. A Kank is a four-star. All right, that's good. That's good. And that is pretty much it, guys. What a sad story, isn't it? What a sad ending. <laughs> what a what a waste of account. <laughs> and let's look into this one, guys. Okay, two person. Come on. Come on, lady. Give me some luck. Give me some luck. Okay, there's three golden light. Or oh, four golden light. Oh, man. The girl did not pop up this time as well. What a sad life, man. What a sad life. Okay, so there we go, guys. Emil. Mm -hmm. Three star unit. New unit. <gasps> this is a five star hero unit. Wow. Really? Man. I thought I did not get a 5-star net hero unit. Cut. Wow, that's a wifey, man. Oh, bunny wifey, man. Bunny wifey. Man. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. That's good. Oh, shit. I thought Kank was a 5-star net hero unit, but I got this unit right over here. All right. Loading. Come on. Come on. Oh, that's a soul symbol. That's not a character. Oh, shit. I still need to get a really good grasp on this game first. Man, not a single five star net hero unit. Man, just I got I got one that is pretty much a little bit guaranteed when you do it for the first time in the game. When you start a game, you are pretty much guaranteed to get a five star net hero unit. That's what I really do believe. Okay, uh, but the rest is really really hard to get. All right, so that is it, guys. So this is how you do it. 
and when you are done and if you really don't if you really are not really that satisfied with what you have really got so far go back into the login screen and change the account and use the different gmail account or facebook account that you have in order to create a new account in this game and do it again okay yes it can sound a little bit painful but well this is how it is okay this is how it is anyways this is it for today guys i hope you enjoyed this video please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button to keep on enjoying the contents of my channel see you guys in the next video